Good morning. It is Saturday, November 24th, 2018, and Scotty and I are going to have a busy day doing some mixing up of pottery glazes. And I just did my first order of ready to go glaze from Sanding Stone in Winnipeg, Manitoba. And they ship all across Canada and all over the world, they say. And so I thought, well, I like the idea of not having to mix up glazes. So I gave them a call on Remembrance Day weekend or texted them through Instagram and they were just so helpful. And I placed my first order. It came really quickly. And so now today is the day I'm going to mix up glaze. Scotty will not be able to partake because he doesn't have a, a dust mask like this. So the reason why I wanted to order this glaze is because I didn't want to have to order all the other little ingredients to make up glaze. And I thought, well, this will be a fast way to get something lovely and consistent. And I did look at some YouTube videos online at Amico Brent, and I was really impressed with how the glazes were turning out. So I just wanted to show you what it's all about, in case you're like a little bit nervous about you know, making this purchase and, and doing it that way. All right, so here it is. So this is called, I hope I'm pronouncing it wrong, Celadon Storm C27. I'm take a look at that. So this will be good for cone six. I do cone six at home in my garage. And I also do cone six at Courtney Elementary School on Vancouver Island in Courtney. And um, if I'm happy with this, I think for some of the older kids at school, I would bring this and let them try doing dipping glaze because we usually do paint on glaze. All right, that's the dehumidifier making clunking noises in the background. All right, so what's this all about? Let's find out. You want this, Scotty? You want that? Okay. Let's open it up and see what we're dealing with here. <laughs> Is this scary, Scotty? Ooh, Coolio, Coolio. Okay. It is powder. Okay, I'm just gonna have to so carefully tip it so you can see. Okay, and these are my instruction sheets. Okay, all right, here's my how-to sheet. Yep, excellent. Okay, got it, got it, got it. I already looked online and I knew I'd be needing some things. It's going to tell me about specific gravity. I already checked online, did some like math practice with my husband because he's the smart guy with that type of math. And uh, we had fun with that. Okay, so mixing instructions. It's all about the water and using the mask. Eye protection. Excellent. Good. Okay, so clear and concise instructions are right here. I anticipate zero problems following these instructions. I've got my bucket with my powder glaze. All right, and I have got my hand whisk, plus I have my uh, husband's DeWalt, and I have a uh, paint mixer attachment. I'll be doing that too. And I have got, not this mask, but this mask and when you are mixing your uh, powdered glazes. So this is an NIOSH approved uh, face mask. So this is the mask I'll be wearing and I need to read to see the instructions, but I also put um, like safety goggles over my eyes and the other ingredient I need 
is my distilled water. It tells you how much water to put in and um, to put in like 90% of the water because you could always add more water but you can't take it out. So my goal for today, this Saturday, is to mix this up. They also suggest that I let it sit for a while before I start doing my test tiles. So today is just going to be my first mixing day, let it sit, and then tomorrow I'll mix it again and I'll do my first test tiling to see how it goes. So yeah, things will be heating up in my little garage. So yep, totally impressed so far with how easy this seems to do. Can't wait to show off my color storm. And now, I'm going to gear up, get the dog out of here so it doesn't breathe in anything. And I'm going to make up glaze. So yeah, really happy so far with how easy this seems to be. I really just like things to be easy. Life is complicated enough, so take the easy route. I love it. All right. Hey, Scotty. All right, have a good day. Ciao, ciao.